there are a lot of forms of entertainment around the world. Buckle your seatbelts, everyone. It's time to explore some entertainment. <sighs> well, that was a musical masterpiece, wasn't it? Was it not? Well, if you like music, subscribe to the channel, because I also have music on this channel. Oh, and subscribe for other forms of content here as well on this channel. But less about subscriptions, more about the topic. Didn't that music masterpiece sound so familiar to you, or seem so familiar to you? Typing out words and making it sing out on your phone? Doesn't that sound so familiar to you? Maybe it should if I said Ditty by Zaya, spelt Z Y A. This thing. <laughs> Oh, and copyright disclaimer, just in case I do get any copyright hits, this is my own research and my own commentary. And because research and comments are part of the Copyright Fair Use Act, this video is not allowed to be struck by any copyright claims. Just wanted to get that out of the way. So, uh, no copyright because research and comments are part of the fair use play. On the 1st of September 2015, ZYA or Zaya created an app known as Ditty. But what is Ditty? Ditty was an app where you could basically just type out any words you wanted into this text box and then what it would do is whatever text you put in the text box it would turn that said text into a song so it will convert it into a music thing hence why it's called Ditty. Ditty is a small song. This is usually type something out in a little text box and it turns it into a small song that ended up being part of the main app itself ditty but before we visit any ditty compilations what is zaya or zya what is it zaya or zya was founded off by matt Soletic which also was the founder-CEO of Virgin Records. They, this person ended up creating Zaya Rec the Zaya Music thing, and it was them that ended up building Ditty. But what happened pre-Ditty? Before Ditty was a thing, back in 2013, Zaya or ZYA created an interesting game. It was a game basically where you could build your own songs, a bit more of a playful way to build your own music, adding your own vocals, adding your own if, instrumentals and stuff, and even having to have some ideas of texting out your lyrics and maybe having different backing vocals and stuff. That's what kind of Ditty's ground was, like perhaps maybe like texting out different forms of lyrics for like backing vocals and that would be performing inside your actual songs in like the song creation game that they did before Ditty. That was like pre Ditty series. I'm not 100% too educated in like what was happening before Ditty but I'm a huge fan of the Ditty world so let's just move on to that. So after this said game thing, after this game thing that's when Ditty came into place. The social media platforming music app where you could text out your, the lyrics to whatever you wanted and it would turn it into a song. Hence why we've got it known as Ditty. So it's type out whatever you want, turns it into a song. I actually did experiment with Ditty myself uh, back when it existed, obviously it opened in 2015 and it only existed in life for four years 2015 to 2019 it ran 
So it was running throughout the Vine slash early TikTok years of time. So it was running through the Vine era and the uh, musically slash pre TikTok era sort of thing. So it was running between Vine musically and TikTok era. So like 2015 to 2019, that sort of gap. So it was like just reaching before Vine's death. In 2017, Vine died. Rest in peace to Vine, but this is less about Vine. This is more about Ditty. So Ditty was created in around about that sort of frame of time. It basically was another way just to have a bit of fun with music. Typing whatever you wanted and it would turn it into a song. And it was only a very short, quick song. Hence why it was named as Ditty. And it was a huge masterpiece. Ditty ended up being an explosive app. Gaining many of people installing the app just so they could have fun with creating some musical masterpieces just with the tap of a keyboard on their phone. That was the fun of Ditty at that time. And it made some amazing compilations like these ones. Guys, the doctors said I have a million miles at man's boomer. I don't know what that is, but it's time to pick in the Fortnite characters. Is I at my room, my mom is so proud that she's crying. Do you ever beat your dick so fucking hard that you start? Ditty was made for. It was made for the fun, entertaining side of things. 
making those different forms of compilations you've just seen. Some of them were very strange, very cringy, very weird, but it was fun. It was just something to enjoy and something just to play along with. And it was a really good game. It was a shame that once I found out it was going to get cut off, I was absolutely mental. I literally... It was just awful. But yeah, it was an absolute masterpiece of fun to literally have many different forms of different memes that came from Vine and other forms of different fun that people could have in Ditty. It was just a really good app when it was around. And having that chance just to feel free and just make any stories you wanted out of just random stuff and get them turned into random strange songs. It was good. It was good. Until 2019 came around, then, all of a sudden, Zaya, or ZYA, just comes around the corner in October and says, Ditty's dead. Ditty's gonna die. And it did. Ditty doesn't exist anymore. I wish it never had died. It was such a masterpiece. Please, if anyone from ZYA or Zaya sees this video, Please suggest to bring Ditty back because it was a masterpiece. The amount of stories that people had done, the the craziness and cringiness of them, it was just something fun and enjoyable for people to do. And actually cutting that off was just not a good move, in my opinion. It just wasn't a good move. And I wish it could come back. Ditty was only very young at the time that it got killed. I mean, four years of running... That is not really a big amount of time. And it was quite a huge success. Quite a pretty big thrusting success. Nearly as successful as TikTok is right now. That almost at that level of succession was within Ditty's power. But yeah, they cut it off and it was a big shame that they did. I loved every second of Ditty. Watching some of the compilations, yes, it was kind of cringy, but that was the fun of it. It was a fun, enjoyable thing where you could just text out whatever the hell that you wanted and then get it turned into a song. Which was something that's never been done before, I believe, in the history of those sort of apps. It was something that Ditty did that just made it so much cooler. It had that sort of influence of just fun and enjoyability in making or doing whatever you wanted by just typing in random words. I don't know, if you wanted to type out the word cheese, it would just make a song that just says cheese over and over again, like Cheese, 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 something like that, yeah, like cheese, all it would say is just cheese, or if you wanted to make a song about, I don't know, soup, I ate chocolate soup and it was so yummy in my belly, something like that, you know? That was the whole point about it. It was like just typing random things and having fun jingles made out of them. That was the power. That was the fun of Ditty. But then, dead. Gone. Killed off. Never to return. But, please. If there is any developers still out there that made Ditty, please bring it back. Bring it back. Just do it. We, we loved it. It was a masterpiece. I loved it. Too. All the people loved it too. I just want it back. It was just something about it that was so unique compared to any other social media app out there. Did it was a good one. And it was a shame to say goodbye and let it go and let it die. It was, it was just a down floor for me. They should have kept it alive. They never should have killed it off. So please... If you are any form of a developer of Ditty, bring it back. It needs to come back, and fast. So many people loved it, and so many people were absolutely deprived when it was announced that it was going to no longer exist. It was going to fall off and exist no longer. As soon as it was confirmed it was going down, everyone was completely deprived by it. It needs to come back. Pretty please. We need it. And that is basically... That is a bit of exploration of Ditty. Join me next time with another exploration of entertainment very soon. Don't know what it will be, 
but I'm sure it will be entertaining anyway. Stay tuned to the channel, subscribe as well. I'll see you all with another video very soon. Bye.